Welcome to another video, Marketing Minute. I'm Eric Kalis, Chief Marketing Officer for Square2 Marketing. In today's video, Marketing Minute, we have a news flash. The sharing platform, Shareaholic, came out with an amazing report that shows that search traffic is actually dropping and social media traffic is doubling. Sounds a little technical? Maybe, but it's really critical for you as the marketer, small business owner, or entrepreneur to understand exactly what this means for your business. In the past six months or so, at Square2 Marketing, we've noticed that a lot of clients have been getting more and more traffic from social media. In fact, some clients are even getting more traffic from social media now than they are from organic search. So it was interesting to see this report because it kind of validates some of the things that we were seeing going on inside. Here are some stats that show you what we're talking about. In November of 2012, search traffic accounted for almost 42% of traffic, while social re referrals were just over 11%. But a year later, in November of 2013, search traffic had actually slipped a few percentage points while social referrals had more than doubled. So here's some takeaways why. Basically, search's heyday is over. Everybody uses search engines. So search engines might find individual increases in um, traffic, but for the most part, everybody's using search. The market is not gonna grow. But social media, a media that's barely outgrown its diapers, things are just getting started. Referrals from the top five social media platforms more than doubled, growing 111% year over year. People are just more active on social media than ever, and social media is nowhere near full maturity. Indeed, it's just the beginning. So if you're a marketer, here are five things that you can do to take advantage of this exciting news. One, stop obsessing over keywords. Like it or not, Google is gonna prevent you from seeing which keywords are driving search. And that's because they don't want you focusing on keywords anymore. So get used to thinking in terms of the questions that will get you the top rankings that you're looking for. Number two, don't neglect social media because you don't use it or don't understand it. Your prospects are hanging out on social media whether you believe so or not. The numbers just don't lie. The above report on traffic references that people are coming to you from social media. And even if your corporate sites are lacking, chances are they're going to your social media sites. Number three, track traffic and leads from search and social to make decisions based on your company data. Analytics is more important than ever. You're going to need them to know how many visitors are coming to your site from social and from search, but more importantly, how many leads you're going to get from social versus search. Besides seeing an increase in social traffic, we're also seeing more leads from social than from search, something for you to consider. Number four, make sure your search, social, and other inbound marketing programs are tightly integrated. Today, it's likely that your social media sites are visited by the same amount of people as your website. And if your social sites aren't quite up to par, these visitors may be thinking about doing business with your competitors because they're just not impressed. And number five, and probably most important, leverage highly creative and educational content across both search and social platforms. We've talked about the visitor experience over and over again, and this couldn't be even more important when you talk about driving traffic to your website. If you have an educational offer on your website that are not on your social media sites, you might want to consider making sure that they match. Listen, if you execute these five inbound marketing program changes in 2014, I guarantee you'll see a pop in your marketing results. I hope I got you thinking differently about your sales and marketing. And for more information like this, please check out square2marketing.com and we'll see you next week.